wakati nchi kiendelea kusononeka kutokana na janga la wiki iliyopita katika shule ya Ilsa Dendarasha kaunti ya Nyeri Waziri wa Usalama wa Ndani Kindiki Kithure amesisitiza kuwa wanafunzi wote wamehesabiwa baada ya shughuli za kuwatafuta na kuchakata taarifa kukamilika. Currently as, as we are here the police are guarding the scene and investigations are on. Shule hiyo ina jumla wanafunzi 843 ambapo 330 ni wanafunzi wa bweni kati ya hao 164 ni wavulana na 166 ni wasichana. Kati ya wavulana 164 wa grade ya 4 hadi 8, 143 wamethibitishwa kuwa hai huku 140 wakiwa na wazazi wao kwa sasa na 21 wakiangamia na moto huo. Any other person trying to play whatever game trying to advance some whatever other statistics is a heartless criminal and an enemy of the society because when we are hurting at a time like this this is not the time to bring triviality. Kindiki pia ameapa kwa serikali tahakikisha wahusika wa moto huo pamoja na wale waliokosa kutimiza wajibu wao watachukuliwa hatua za kisheria. We will pursue and get justice on behalf of the families. And all those people who may have contributed to this tragedy through action, inaction, conduct, misconduct advertently inadvertently will be brought to account Aidha mpasuaji mkuu wa maitwa serikali Johnson Odor akiwa na timu yake wamechunguza miili ya wavulana 21 waliopoteza maisha yao kutokana na moto huo All of them uh, had uh, varying degrees of burns uh, which uh, were caused by fire uh, so upon doing the autopsy because uh, what you noted that uh, they were they were un- unidentifiable meaning that uh, because of the fire Uh, it was difficult for the relatives to really identify who really uh, were their children so with that uh, we shifted uh, to the laboratory in which now we have taken samples for analysis wazazi wanafunzo wili waliokufa kutoka na majeraha wakiwa hospitalini walikuepo wakati wa uchunguzi wa miili siku ya leo they'll be compared with the samples which, which were taken earlier from the from the fathers and mothers of the disease which now will be reconciled so that now we'll be able to see uh, whose child is who. Serikali inaendelea kuchunguza chanzo cha moto huo huku familia zilizoathirika zitalazimika kusubiri kwa mwezi mmoja baada ya mchakato wa leo ili kuwatambua pendo wao na kuwapa mazishi yanayostahili huku serikali kiahidi kugharamia mazishi. Mariam Jahid K24 Nyeri